This is Master Geo here at WinterCon 2018 with David Howard Thornton. How are you doing, David? Doing very well. How are you doing? Perfect. So how was WinterCon? I was going well so far. I'm having a fun time. I've, this is my fourth year coming out here to this convention. Oh. I've usually come as a guest, not well, not on this side of the table, but yeah, being on the other side of the table. So I'm enjoying it being on this side of the table now. So that, That's cool. Yeah. Uh, who have you uh, enjoyed meeting in the past? Oh, gosh. I mean, I, I've met a lot of... God, yeah remember like Uhura from like Star Trek of course but I'm like I, I came here with uh, my uh, YouTube series I'm part of called Nightwing Escalation the past three years so I usually came as Joker so I was out here on the floor just having fun with people so uh, yeah cool cool I get to be myself <laughs> yes so how did you get involved with Art the Clown oh I got involved with it um basically it's like the original actor that played Art decided to retire from acting so they put an audition up on uh, an, uh, Actors Access which is a a website for us actors and they were looking for a tall skinny guy that had clowning or physical comedy experience so I thought hey that sounds perfect for me so I went in to audition for it and knocked it out of the park and here I am now. If uh, for a person who's never seen Terrifier how would you describe it to them? I would say it's a nice throwback slash homage like 70s and 80s classic slasher flicks that are just heavy on like violence and like gore all that kind of stuff a lot of jokes in there as well but you know light on plot you know it's this very basic story where this uh, killer clown encounters some women on Halloween night and tracks them down and kills them and everybody else that gets in his way. How have you been feeling? Because uh, the word of mouth, everyone's loved it, you know, especially now that it's on Netflix, that's even blown up bigger. How does that feel to you? Oh, it's fantastic. We did not expect that at all. We're, we're just a small little independent film, and it just it exploded, especially once we came out on Netflix. It's, it's the fans. They have really embraced it, and they have gotten the word out about this film. So I'm like, I'm just... My mind's been blown over the whole entire thing. How does it feel when people cosplay as Art the Clown? Oh, I love it. I love it. Because I've done cosplay myself. So <laughs> I'm like, this is, a, this is like, the, it's, it's one of the most bizarre things to see someone actually cosplay someone you've actually played before. Right, right. So I'm like, I love it. Love it. Uh, where did you guys shoot uh, Terrifier at? We filmed out in like Trenton, New Jersey, a little bit out in Staten Island, also in Long Island. So we're local. Okay. <laughs> Where was that pizza place that you guys shot at? That's at Deer Hills Pizza down out there in Staten Island. Okay. Uh, not not Staten uh, Long Island. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right, all right. And how long was the shoot? Uh, well, we originally wanted to do like six weeks shooting, but we had some setbacks, stuff like that, had to raise more money. So it ended up being like a year and a half off and on because we would come back and decide to add some more into the film. And so you'd go back for reshoots and stuff like that. So it took a little bit longer than usual. You know, when you don't have a big studio behind you, you don't have the kind of budget, so you have to make do with what you have, and you have to, like, you know, get a little bit creative sometimes. Uh, my favorite scene, I'm sure it's a lot of people's favorite scene, is the Catherine Corcoran kill, which oh, is, like, yes. so brutal. How was it shooting that scene? Yeah, it was probably better for me than it was for her. I mean, she went through all kinds of hell for that. I mean, first of all, when they made the full body cast of her, she got stuck in the mold, so they almost had to take her to the ER for that. And then when we filmed that night, it was 20 degrees that night. We had no heat in that room, so she had to do that, hanging upside down naked like that, for a few hours. And we'd only let her hang upside down for like 30 seconds of time. we put her back up right, so right, she right. wouldn't get too sick or anything right, like right, that. Right. But. It, I mean, she did not complain at all. She just totally went with it, and she was, I, I say Catherine's our MVP of the film. I mean, she went all out for this, and uh, she, that's like the scene everybody talks about, so we all owe it to Catherine. She's, she's an amazing person. Everybody that worked on the film is amazing. But I, Catherine, good job, girl. Well, it's memorable <laughs> enough to get its own uh, Scooby-Doo yeah. parody. <laughs> exactly, exactly. <laughs> Uh, how was do, the, how long did it take to get you made up as Art the Clown? That usually took about three to four hours. I mean, sometimes longer because Damien, the director, would also do my makeup. So he would sometimes have to leave me to go set up a shot, come back, do a little bit more makeup, then go s film a shot, come back. So and there were a few nights where I was in the chair for like eight hours. Wow. Yeah, just waiting. Just do 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 do. <laughs> did you enjoy the process? Oh, yeah. It's fun. I mean, it went by fast for me. 
it's, it's just, I love, I've done a lot of, like, just growing up in the theater, I did a lot of children's theater, so I always had, like, the characters that had crazy makeup anyway, so I'm used to it, so... It's, I figure if you know Doug Jones can do it, right. so can I. Right, right. <laughs> well, I love that shirt. How does it feel to be on like so many horror t-shirts? I right? love it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm such a big geek. I love this kind of stuff. So just like this is amazing. I'm like, <laughs> I'm merchandise. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Do you have anything lined up? Um, right now, I'm still working on Nightwing, so I, we're still filming season three of Nightwing, where I play the Joker, so I'm having fun doing that. And right now, we're writing the sequel to uh, Terrifier, so we're hoping to get start making that next year, uh, knock on wood. So we'll see how that goes. So we'll You guys going to be shooting in uh, the New York, New Jersey area? I, I anticipate us okay. doing that, yeah. yeah. Just depends like whatever locations we need to for the films, right. you know, but I... I I think we want to try to keep as local as we can, so yeah. All right. Well, thank you so much. I love the movie. It's one of my favorites of the year, and you were just badass in that film, man. Thank you very much, man. All right. Thank you.